What's up, guys? This is Wishbone. We got Prime Energy Orange Mango. Today we're gonna focus on whale. Let's focus on one of the big stickers on here. So we got 200 milligrams of caffeine, no sugar, 300 milligrams of electrolytes, and what is it? And it's vegan. It's vegan. So today we're gonna focus on 300 milligrams of electrolytes. So 300 milligrams of electrolytes. If you are trying to use this, that's that's pure marketing. I wouldn't worry about getting it for that. Uh, 300 milligrams of electrolytes is kind of a joke. Um, you have potassium, magnesium, and sodium. Um, those are all just negligible amounts of electrolytes. I will get the numbers up. I'll post them in the comments below later. Um, those are all negligible amounts of electrolytes. Uh, if you're looking for electrolytes, literally just get yourself an actual electrolyte supplement like uh, Dr. Berg's electrolyte supplement or the one that doesn't taste the greatest, some Him pink Himalayan sea salt and a couple teaspoons in, in whatever you're drinking or just by itself. Um, but Prime, I looked at the ingredients, there's really nothing to write home about in here. Um, it is basically just a caffeinated, highly caffeinated soda with 200 milligrams for 11 for 12 ounces. Um, looking at the ingredients, I mean, you know, you have just your standard uh, carbohydrates, three grams of sugar, basically three grams of carbohydrates. Uh, we have calcium, potassium, vitamin B6 and B12, and magnesium, so, so sodium. Uh, looking at the regular ingredients, you know, you have carbonated filtered water, coconut water, uh, from concentrated citric acid, natural flavor, calcium lactate, magnesium citrate. Ooh, magnesium citrate. Oh, that's funny. Drink too much of that, you got diarrhea. <laughs> uh, potassium citrate, sodium citrate, caffeine, sucralose, potassium sorbate, sodium benzoate, which is the preservative for it, L-theanine, inositol, uh, glucorono, oh man, that's a word, glucoronolactone, taurine, acesulfame, potassium, pyri pyridoxine. Uh, hydrochloride, or pyridoxine hydrochloride, which is the vitamin B6, and cyanocobalamin. That's the one that I was looking, and it looks like cyanocobalamin in oral form, if I remember right, so that's the synthetic vitamin B12. It um, doesn't absorb well orally. Um, it looks like the preferred method of injection. Now, mind you, I'm looking at uh, just a couple things. Obviously, there's no research coming out all, all the time, but I'm just looking at a couple of the older research that just says the uh, preferred method for cyanocobalamin uh, ingestion is actually through intramuscular injection. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Here's the taste test, though. We got orange mango. Ooh, smells good. It smells more orangey than mangly. Hmm. No? No, I can smell both. Ooh, that's really good. That's really good. Wow. Hmm. I like that a lot. I really can't taste the coconut water in there, but that's okay. We're not doing it for that. Hmm. Yeah, I would definitely, if I'm feeling that orange mango, like I would definitely, this is for orange, I would definitely go out of my way to find this and buy this again if I need that orange pick me up, that orange sodium. Anyways, this is Wishbone, this is Viking Zero.